Hi everybody, this is Mr. Duncan in England. How are you today? Are you okay? I hope so. Are you happy? I hope so. In today's lesson, we're going to talk all about saying hello and goodbye. When we first meet someone, whether it is a person we know or someone we are meeting for the first time, we will normally use a simple sentence as a way of greeting them. A greeting is a friendly way of opening a conversation or as a way of letting the other person know that we have seen them. There are many ways to say hello. Hi. Hello. Hi there. Hello there. Hey, how are you doing? Howdy, friend. What's up? How's it going? Wow, it's good to see you. We sometimes use a double greeting. For example, hi there. Hey, how are you doing? Hello, how have you been? It's good to see you. How's life been treating you? If you are meeting someone for the first time, you can say, good to meet you. It's nice to meet you. I'm pleased to meet you. It's a pleasure to meet you. These sentences are often used after the other person has been introduced to you. If you are meeting someone you have not seen or heard from for a long time, then you can show real surprise and shock. Oh my God, it's you! Ah, where have you been? My goodness, long time no speak. Wow, it's so good to see you again. Is it really you? When did we last meet? Wow, as I live and breathe, it's my best friend from school. <sighs> if you are in a hurry, there may only be a short time in which to make your greeting. Hi, sorry, I can't stop. Oh, hi there. Look, I'm a bit pushed for time. Here's my phone number. Give me a call sometime. Hello there. Look, I'm on my way to work. Maybe catch up with you again soon? Hey, I would love to stop and chat, but I really have to dash. This type of greeting is common these days because we are all in such a big hurry to get someplace fast. We sometimes use the word hello as a way of showing surprise or as a way of expressing a sudden interest in something. Hello, what's going on here? Hello, I did not know he had a girlfriend. Hello, what's going on over there? Hello, something is wrong here. He took my money. Here in the UK, people will often greet each other by talking about the weather. Hello, isn't it a lovely day? Hello, what about this terrible weather? Hello, did you hear the storm last night? In many countries, people will ask about the family. Hello, how's the family? Hello, how's your wife doing? Hello, how are the kids? In China, people will often greet each other by asking if they have eaten their lunch or dinner or ask them where they are going. The word hello can also be used informally as a way of expressing sarcasm or annoyance. Hello, did you understand what I said? 
Hello, was that too difficult for you to read? Hello, did you see me waving at you? Hello, do you not recognize me? Hello, what time do you call this? You are late! <clears throat> Parting is such sweet sorrow that I shall say good night till it be morrow. <laughs> That's Shakespeare, that is. Saying goodbye. There are many ways to say goodbye. Bye. Bye for now. Bye bye. See ya. So long. Ciao. Later. Cheerio. See you around. Farewell. Ta-ra. See you again. Ta-ta for now. Catch you later. Goodbye. You will often hear me say ta-ta at the end of my English lessons. This expression is mostly used in certain parts of the UK. It is a friendly, fun way to say goodbye. Well, I have come to the end of this lesson, so I must bid you a fond farewell. Until next time, we meet here on the Super Duper Internet Highway. This is Mr. Duncan in England saying thank you for watching me teaching you. And ta-ta for now. <laughs>